Maybe Chinatown? A really good restaurant. Do you like see? Right. Just so the campus was a baby pier for it. There's on a documentary uh -huh. on called Extreme Trains. Oh, yeah, <laughs> it's okay, on as YouTube. we go through this building, uh, again, what they're doing, these are long pits in them where they can go under the train mm -hmm. to do the inspection. We'll now travel north from the yard through Union Station. Union Station was completed in 1925. It's both a terminal and a crew station and we will pass through the entire facility on the east side. As we enter the station on the west side of the train, you will see the former U.S. mail facility directly under Chicago's old post office. This location is one that will see the reuse of a host of Amtrak activities in coming years. As we work to increase capacity for uh, and allow Union Station to handle the continued growth of rail travel. Sits open. They, they didn't put marshmallows in. 
My understanding is that we took more of that one. The guys got screwed on the barbecue box. And Daly was upset. Daly was upset. He said, Chicago and Illinois codes are stricter than the U.S. codes for the past year. I just got this on my backpack. Yeah, he had no jurisdiction. Now I think I've never seen him in the building for three bottles of marshmallows. to these platforms because it was the last train but on my way to Milwaukee I came from came out board on the north platform but on my way home I got off of the south platform because it was the last train of the day Looks like a train came in just now. And right I'm now, what we're doing is passing by Hiawatha. Oh, that one like the train I took. At the Hiawatha service. On this side only two Amtrak routes come through here. The Empire Walter and Empire Builder. Children. So, I only taken took the Hiawatha, of course. But I plan on taking the Empire Builder one day. It'll be a fun trip.
Kiddush. Sure enough, we go to the South Beach. Music we're going to play golf, so we trade it. So we trade with the bank here at Waterdale, and we have the South Beach, which we had never seen. Sure enough, there was a rabbi who blocked the way he was a hooker. No, we didn't see any gear.
evidence you could get it to. Right? Talk about it now, man. <clears throat>
Okay, can't you in my video? If you don't mind. Should, you should have us as a <laughs> So, are you enjoying it? Yes, wonderful time. Wonderful time. Everyone on YouTube, these you. two, they mean a lot to me. They're my closest friends, Bernie McKee, and he. I've known him ever since I was in about first, second, or third grade. And Mr. Crawford, he used to be my teacher and my counselor at high school. But I didn't go to that school for long. But he took me as his kind of like a second... <laughs> Dad, thank you to me, yeah. and he's I. We've been friends ever since. And you were too big to spank. Yeah, <laughs> and I would like I would like to say thank you for thank you. everything you've done, Bernie. Thank oh. you for taking me to Galesburg, to Union, mm -hmm. and to the East Troy Railway Museum. And on top of that, the South Shore Line. And Mr. Crawford, thank you for taking me to so many Loyola games. And the Sox games. And everything. And thank you for being there for me and my mom. I really appreciate it. And... This is my way of saying thank you. I hope you enjoyed it. Very much, very much. And <laughs> if you <laughs> want to do this again, tell me. Mm -hmm. And I will.
so this is me flying safely on the Amtrak excursion train and here's my face finally showing everyone on YouTube what I look like. I was planning on doing it for a special occasion and this is it. And to let you know I adore trains and I can have it any other way. And I've loved train ever since I was little. And it will always be that way. And I hope you're all enjoying the trip and enjoying your day. Rate, comment, and subscribe to Brian Sively 2001. And here, Brian Sively, <laughs> wishing you a nice day. And soon we'll be going back into the Chicago Union Station. And we'll be getting off and getting lunch and getting stuff. And hopefully, by the time I get home and have my phone charged, I'll show everyone what I got today. And probably do an unboxing and I'll be posting this video either tomorrow or Monday. So be sure to enjoy it. It's Saturday. Rate, comment, and subscribe. Sounded good. Sounded good. <laughs> Thanks. I've been doing this since last year and I brought up the courage yes. and how many yeah. people have you heard from? I have 16 subs Good. and I'm planning on doing let's plays of some games I want and one of them coming up I'm thinking of uh, is Sovel Night and another one might be number nine the spiritual successor to Mega Man yeah being Capcom isn't doing anything can't see any food ain't left Capcom a couple of years ago and opened up his own gaming studio, Concept. They made few games and collab on few too. And one particular game they announced to a couple years back was Mighty Number no. Nine. And I, I was gonna get it on Kickstarter, but nah. Some people are telling me, wait, it's a good thing. They recently announced a physical release. So, I'm getting that. Mm -hmm. And Bernie, don't tell Bud this, but... I do have a PlayStation 4 now, and, yeah, don't, so keep it between you and me. I do have a PlayStation 4, and I'm loving it, yeah, and it's helping me calm down, yeah, yeah. I have a PlayStation 3 and Vita. So, yeah. And I'm excited about this year. Yeah. This year was too good. 
Yep. Ooh, an Amtrak train. Oh, that the train I took. Train, that the engine that had uh, my train, train 90, engine 93. Yeah, on my Hiawatha trip. Okay, this is Metro though, right? Or Amtrak? Amtrak. Okay. I can't tell. That's right. It probably is California Zephyr it's or South. Sure, it doesn't have an observation or a no. dining car. Or Southwest Chief. I wouldn't have a dining and observation car. A long distance train. But it should have those things. 